Whoa, you're recording. I thought you were going to say, like, three, two, one, go. Like an okay, actual ready? movie director. Ready. Three, two. Welcome to Rocket Anywhere, the show where we insert, insert phrase, phrase here. You, you missed to do here. this here. Yes, yes, yes. We're recording mono today, so that <coughs> might be why I can only hear myself in one ear. I don't know. I know, I can only hear you in one ear and me in no ear. Or it could just be this headphone splitter I'm using. But anyway, that doesn't change that we always go to follow up first. Why does it say jokes and gags? I don't know what you're looking at. This, this, okay, wait, this mustache thingy? Uh, She's this, referring to those fake mustaches you can put on yourself. Yeah. This mustache thingy, I got it, and it, it said jokes and gags. And now I understand why it says gags, because every time I put one on, I'll start gagging because the hair is <laughs> in my mouth. your mouth. Okay. Despite all that, nothing changes from follow-up. We get started with it all the time. We have given the yogurt a second chance, the and yogurt, it tastes good. The yogurt. The yogurt. Yogurt. Like they say, I'm Peppa Pig. Yogurt. So, back in episode no, three... Pepe. It's Pepe. Pepe. Pepe the flea. Pepe. 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 We, refer, we were talking about uh, that Activa yogurt in episode three and how it made Activa. our stomachs hurt so bad. And how we were stuck in a certain room for a really long time because I'm of really cross-eyed. I don't know where these remarks come from. From me looking in at the microphone and then seeing only one and a half of them. I know. Uh, we have given the Activa yogurt a second chance, or referring to me, and it... Somewhat tastes better. I thought you liked Chobani. I don't. I liked Chobani better. It's Chobani. Just, I don't like. I don't know why there's that white stuff on top, but because we're gonna find you out buy why. Them old. Uh, Sophia asked last week, "What does embarrassment mean?" I did. So, yeah, you did. Oh yeah, I remember. Now I have my most embarrassing moment. Hold on, we'll get to that in a second. After Come this. on, I always have to So, wait. embarrassment is an emotional state of intense discomfort with oneself experienced when having a socially unacceptable act or condition witnessed or revealed to others. A.K.A. when something weird happens in front of someone else that you don't want them to see it. That happens to you or the other person? You. Now you tell your most embarrassing story. <sighs> I have to wait ten seconds. Okay. Um... It happened last Sunday. It all happened on a rainy, stormy night. No. It all happened last Sunday. It was a typical Sunday. No. Well, yes, it was. Except for the fact that I had... Sherlock Holmes. Private Eye. <laughs> no. Then you fell Cut asleep? Cut this whole thing up. The end. <laughs> wow, that's, that's real embarrassing. That <laughs> okay. is so embarrassing. Half of the stuff you don't need to know. It's uh, it's on a need to know basis. No. Okay. Next thing and follow up and last thing, you asked what excuse moi means, and it just means it's well according to my research, there are many controversial subjects over it, whether or not it's real, but from what I have found, the common it's use. It's French. Fake French. No, it's French, except the English people don't pronounce it right. From what I saw. The pronunciation of moi, as in W M A, no M W A, excuse my dyslexia there. It just like fake French, so that's that. So it's English. Yes. Okay, and it just means excuse me. Yep. Okay. Those people add so many syllables. Let's move on to thought of the week. This is the new segment we're. You have to say, let's move on. Yes, yes, we must. We already say. finished, so just go. Okay, thought of the week is what is it with the year 2000 from 1999 to 2001, 2002? What is, was it with those years and stripes? Stripes. What about the song Stars and Stripes Forever? No, I'm talking about They're as in. Friends. They're only for four years. I'm talking about like striped t shirts or all, all sorts of striped things. So. Oh, 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 okay, never mind. Yeah, so think of, think of Blue's Clues and the guy You're who sitting did... sitting on stripes. Who did... Yes, I am. I have a striped seat cushion. Think of the guy... I'm who, wearing stripes. The guy who did Blue's Clues, he always wore a striped t-shirt. Striped, collared, long-sleeve shirt. Yeah, 
Now think of of me when I was little. Look at pic- think of little pictures of me. Do you see me wearing stripes? Yes. Okay. Think of pictures of our parents when we I was were wearing younger. stripes. Everyone in the two thousands. My rub and dad and his were side to side. Everyone in the two thousands wore stripes. If you if you think you didn't, look we're at pictures of We're in the two thousands, son. <laughs> the common trend right now is to solid wear solid colors. Yeah, solid colors. Because it's solid. Okay. Or or uh, t-shirts promoting things. I promote myself. Like, if you ever know... No, that was a t-shirt. I saw it at the mall. Yeah, Somebody I, was wearing yeah, it. Someone's, I promote myself t-shirt. I was like... I came up to them like, good. And then I pointed and, to their shirt and they were like, And what? right now, if you're from Texas, and if you're from Texas, you know that practically every kid has a shirt that says Tyler's on it. What is it with those t-shirts? Yeah, and then, okay, you know the schools have shirts that, uh, like, it says, like, blank, blank, middle school or like, high or whatever? Yeah, yeah, like, uh, let's use Leave It to Beaver as an example, Mayfield High. Yeah. Well, okay, my friend had one that said Highland Park Middle School, okay? Okay. And then I asked her... Do you go to that school? She said, no, never been. Yeah, it's I'm cool. like, where'd you get the shirt then? She's it's like, like their older sisters or something. No, no. And I said, did your older sister go? Because she does have an older sister. Sister. And so her sister didn't go there either. And I'm like, do your parents go or something? And she's like, no. And I said, well, where'd you get it? And she said, at the mall. I'm like, they sell school shirts at the mall. Yeah, it's just like something cool or Don't think we do. don't go to the mall. We do. And, and if you didn't Every know, two years. up there in Highland Park, we're talking about Highland Park, Dallas, Texas. It's up north of Dallas, a little higher up. Highland Yes, yes. Park? There is it's a, a suburb of Highland Park called Sohip. Sohip. He's not pronouncing it right. No, S-O-H-I-P. Sohip. Uh-uh. Yes, I'm serious. If you want to know about that, go to Bonanza episode something. It'll be in the descriptions or at rta.space slash 13. You um, know, the best place to live is on Main Street. <laughs> yeah, because it's so easy to find. Or yeah. the Magic School Bus will be there. No, the Main Street is easy to find, but the place you live on Main Street is hard to find. Yeah, it's Unless it's you live in an alley. You know, uh, in, in Dallas, downtown Dallas, all the restaurants on our Elm Street, not Main Street. Because Elm used to be Main. <laughs> they, had to, they had to shift it over. Yeah, they did. Because of the street remodel and the JFK shooting. Mm-hmm. Let's not bring that That was just a Viori. The, yeah, the Ori. Uh, reference to episode 12. Are you sure we mentioned that? Yeah, we did. I didn't cut oh. it out. Okay, this week's public service announcement is something Sophia and I have... Known for a long time, but we never thought about telling anyone. What? The Disney Channels, plural, have turned. Uh-uh. Not all of them. Well, Mostly. okay. Let's talk about the Disney one, the, the main Disney Channel. What is it? Just sitcoms and... Define sitcom. Uh, I'm teacher. Let's bring on our trusty old friend, Siri. Sitcom is an informal term. It means... <laughs> A situation comedy. Wow. Okay. That's life. They're also... <laughs> it's all the shows on the Disney Channel are also... I was going to say, that's life right there. Yeah. All of them are also just reality TV shows. And it's always like that typical... Those reality TV shows aren't reality. <laughs> yeah. It, it's supposedly the, in quotes, finger quotes, air finger quotes, typical middle school kid reality TV shows, okay? That's not reality. I know it's not reality. That's what they think they should have in reality. But then, they hate it. Yeah, and then you move on to the next Disney Channel show, and that's that Disney XD, and all those cartoons are horrible. I mean, how, how... You're homeschool, don't give your opinion. I know, I know. Homeschoolers' opinions don't count. Okay, okay. Look, Disney XD, how is Phineas and Ferb an educational TV show? How is that Nothing concept? on Disney is supposed to be that educational. <laughs> that educational. Okay, that's all I got to say about Disney XD. You move to Clubhouse Junior, the shows have just been going down. That's a Disney channel? Yeah. I thought that was Adventures in Odyssey or something. No, that's the, that's the Adventures in Odyssey magazine, but I believe it's called Disney 
Clubhouse Junior, Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. That's it, Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. You got I mean, too I mean that, that might have been from two thousand eight because I haven't seen it in so long. And if you if you don't know us in real life, we have not had a TV for five years. Mm, make that six. Yeah, actually, it's gonna be six years. <laughs> six no, years it hasn't been with no TV. And when we did have TV, we didn't even have cable. We have never had cable in our Wait. Life. This was one. How old is he now? Five. Yeah. Six. I was about to say six. Wait. Yeah. So we've ha- we haven't had a TV for like five years. Yeah, it's been a long time. It's been a while. So, public service it's been a while announcement this week: the Disney channels have turned. Okay. No, no, no. It's like this: the Disney channels have turned. And we named it that dun, because dun, dun. of. Because of Mater, turn, like, turn, the turn, pistachio turn, turn. ice cream has turned, turn, 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 turn. Whatever you do, do not eat the free pistachio ice cream. It has turned. Joke of the week. Sophia, get your joke of the week ready because, I mean. I say jokes when I have a joke. Okay, I got My one. My joke was, um, I have a joke now. My okay, joke yeah. was, um. My joke was, what did I say earlier? My joke was? My joke was, Gordon, what did I say earlier? My joke was? <sighs> so pleasant. What did I say when I was, um, when the mattress was on the floor and I was laying on top of it? Wait, I sleep on a mattress that's on the floor. Never mind. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, your mattress is not on wheels. Uh, yours isn't either. Yours is on frames. No, mine's on wheels. No, yours is on frames and the wheels are broken. Because <laughs> <laughs> you, you sat on it too much. <laughs> uh, You're supposed to sleep on it, not sit on it. Well, I gotta work somewhere. You work on the couch that you hog up that's on my side of the room. Okay, that's besides the point. What's your joke? My joke. What did I say earlier? What did I say earlier? No, Gordon, seriously. I said something. I said, I said, uh, a joke and a joke or something like that. But that's episode five. No, I said. Well, we'll get back to it. Okay. I don't have, no, this is it. I don't have a joke. That's my joke and a joke. (laughs) Okay. So I'm like, I don't know. It's way funny early. Always put sunglasses on your tree because then you'll get the proper shade. What is the longest word? It's Christmas already, mommy. <laughs> what is the longest word in the English language? Every single word in the English language without spaces in between. No. Boom. It's smiles because there's a mile between the first and the last letter. I said that one already. Okay. Why did Two the years ago. Why did the peanut butter flop at the talent show? Flop? Yeah, you know, like fail. Oh, it should have been flunk. Emphasis on the word flop. Is this a pun? Yes. I'm just seeing Does Beaver right now snapping. Peanut butter. I'm just seeing Beaver right now snapping his fingers, dancing at the record player. Because it's butter. No, because he didn't have the right jam. Wow. So I have one more joke, and then Sophia can try to figure out what she wants to say. Wait, no, no, no. What's after joke? Word of the day. What's after that? Pick of the week. How many things did you add? We'll find out this week on the show. No, seriously. When are, when's the topics? In a few more topics. There's a little poodle and there's a big dog. The big dog says, My owner just threw me a boomerang. And the little poodle said, If he did, why hasn't it come back? He said, it was a stick. And then the poodle says, that's my favorite type of boomerang. Who's talking? <laughs> a big dog and a little poodle. Oh, I thought it was a, the person who threw the, the stick because they said it was a boomerang, but then it never came back. That That's why it's a stick. Uh, I, I don't even get my own joke here. Did you make that one up? Yeah. Okay, I thought so. Okay, I have a quick story joke to go with this. So I'm going to count I have a lot of stories that are jokes. What? I have a lot of stories that are jokes. Okay, tell one. They're all fake. That's why they're jokes. Okay, this one's fake. I just said a fake one. (laughs) 
Okay. I said um, my stories are fake. That's why they're jokes. But that's a joke because they're not fake. Okay, here's a joke. Story. Joke. You received a note saying, if you're reading this, it happened again. As I look Ooh. at the note, I begin to question. What? I start to panic. Running from room to room, checking if everything is in order. And if everything is where it was last left. Then I run outside and check the cars. No, no one popped the tires. No dents. No broken windows. Nothing stolen. Wait. No, the passenger lock was already there. It says, my sister slammed the door one too many times. I did not add that. That was already in there. Okay. Okay. Uh, It says, I immediately check my phone. No, I'm not a vile sensation. I run back inside and check my bank account. Still got $200 in savings. Uh, How many sound effects? I don't know. At this point, I really start to panic. What went wrong? What happened? What did I do? It's my birthday! I start making phone calls. Grandparents still alive. Everyone else is still alive. I'm Wait. not alive! <laughs> Let me call myself. Wait, what went wrong? I spent so much time panicking that I failed to realize I was late for work again. Ha <laughs> <laughs> uh-huh. Oh, that was on the Reddit. A kid Reddit shouldn't post. read that because they don't work. I work. Uh-uh. How do you think this podcast gets out? You don't go nowhere. I know. I work at home. I, I, I live. I sleep. I sleep, work, and live within two feet of the same couch and bed. Yeah. And I, you know who lives with you, too? Uh, you? No. Your whole family. Yes, of course, yes, yes. I'm not living out in a little shed in the backyard that I built that's barely holding together. You with should. Us. Actually, the shed's been gone for years. Okay. Um, word of the day. before you lived. Word of the day. This one is a little bit like us. Means us somewhat. Phalanx. Pronounced phalanx. Phalanx. There were two pronunciations. Phalanx and phalanx. I think it's pronounced phalanx. How do you spell it? F, no, sorry, P-H-A-L-A-N-X. And because we're not doing guess anymore, it means a number of individuals, especially persons united for a common purpose. So... We're such flanks. <laughs> we're, we are a phalanx, we are phalanx podcasters. No, flanks, not phalanx, flanks. You're from Texas, flanks. <laughs> I feel like you were... Wait, I think Phalanx is Texas. You, you started actually. to sound like Merlin Mann there for a second. My name isn't Merlin. My name is Marilyn. Marilyn. <laughs> okay, let's move on to topics. I have two topics I brought today with Sophia. Because I have she, one. Yeah, yeah, I was going to say she, she brings one. That, that's, I, I have, like, have a say? lot, but I only say one. Okay, say it. <sighs> Why do I say sorry so much? I okay. just realized... Okay. I had, I had, I, I know that I had said sorry a lot, but like, I never, like, I knew it, but well, then I never brought it, like, I never actually thought At least we don't it. say it like Canadians, sorry, sorry. No, 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 offense, no, no, no. I'm Cole. saying. Sorry. No. Okay. My friend on Wednesday, when I was at the youth. I say sorry friend, a lot. I told my story about going down the hallway yelling, I know, I know. I'm telling okay, sorry so wait, much. Wait, so my friend brought it to my attention. Well, not really. No. Uh, well, you found sort out. Of. Yeah, I found it. Okay, it wasn't uh, n- like it wasn't anything bad. I just like I realized, like I actually realized, because I said I was like sorry, 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 and then uh, and then she was like, "Why are you saying sorry?" And I was like, "Boom." Were you Texans? <laughs> and I was like, "Boom." It just hit me. It was an impacting statement. It changed my life. Forever. Yeah, I know. And then I was like, I don't know. And she's like, then don't waste your breath. <laughs> she Tommy didn't say that. Again. No, she didn't say that. She didn't say that. Yeah, well, anyway. I, there's a, if you want to know why, what countries say started the most and why it started, there's a great episode of the Illusionist podcast that uh, talks about why people say sorry. I'll let Sophia listen to it. But that, a link for that podcast will be at rta.space slash 13. Just um, do it for me. Yeah, just do it. For me. And the other Every person. day you say tomorrow, so just do it. Sign See, buff there. I want to make one of those, but saying, just don't do it. 
to the bad what, things. See, the thing is, if they're looking at these motivational videos, they already didn't do it, so it's too late for them. I need some motivation so I can eat. If you haven't eaten, you hey, don't need motivation. Hey, well, some people do need motivation to eat. Well, yes, but most Americans don't. <laughs> <laughs> Look at their Instagram. Uh, yes. <laughs> I, I saw sorry. This, I saw this Instagram description. See, I sorry again. I saw, I saw this Instagram description that said nobody eats until I take a picture. That was real funny. Click 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 click. Yeah, I need every angle here. Okay, my topic Just I'm bringing this week is why Harold in the Purple Crayon. The Don't do that book, again. It's a horror film. That's deep. I'm serious. It is a horror film. If you really think about it, I'm I'm referring to the this HBO. This is a child's film, and what if the children are listening? <laughs> I'm referring to the HBO series, not the Weston Wood series. Um, so think about it. Every day, every I mean every night. Okay. He gets his purple crayon out. Crayon. Crayon. <laughs> he gets He's his praying crayon. with the crayon. I'm he, praying with the crayon. He gets his purple crayon out and he starts to draw the window and as soon as he draws the window he has a blank slate that he starts his world on right sure okay i say sure a lot too and and he starts this world and in this world he creates uh buildings he creates trains he creates forests and all sorts of trains and he starts to create living things he creates flowers he creates humans he flowers creates... aren't living yeah the flowers are alive no they're not okay fine i'll knock that out no but... since since 2008 they weren't alive <laughs> they died in 2008 <laughs> okay the, the fall flowers died in 2008 common known huh? fact fall flowers Oh. Oh. Okay, so he creates humans and he creates all sorts of animals and he interacts with them and they start to know him and he lives with them, he drives the trains and in one example he goes and builds a whole city and creates a whole economy where there's a need for an ad agency and he works for this ad agency. He also creates rockets, he creates a whole universe in that episode. He creates all sorts of planets which have a tiny bit of resemblance to our planets in our solar system. But at the end of this... Thank what, you for spoiling the episode for me. Well, they're not going to watch it. You already seen I it. am. I haven't watched so it. So at the end, and he goes back to his bedroom, when he walks out, you'll notice that everything fades back to white. So everybody... Yeah, the farther he walks away, it fades out. Yeah, so everything and everybody he created, he just killed him. He didn't dun, kill dun, dun. him. He didn't kill him. Well, you see, they, they never just, come. They no. never come back. Yes, because in the next episode, he comes back, and and all the animals are still there. Well, how do you? No, no, because see, he creates his own dog, stuffed animal dog, into a real dog, and a lot of these people don't have any recollection of him. Think about the vast world he creates, and then for him to just wipe it out. I go at it from two points of view. One, he's killing all his people. Or two, look at all the work he just did. Why doesn't any of this save? Like, where's that little save button in the upper left-hand corner? Something to think it's about. It's in the right. No, I'm not talking Windows here. I'm talking Mac. Mac's I awesome. haven't used Windows in years. You've just been using Chrome OS. But that's I haven't the used point. that in months. So that's why I say Harold and the Purple Crayon is a horror film. Or someone scary. Put just it in that category. Think about what he's doing. Just really think Striving about it. Striving for excellence. Uh, don't have nightmares, please. Don't, don't play dun, this dun, dun. Go to bed right now. <laughs> okay. Well, that's it for today. Wait, we're about to go to bed. Don't say anything else. <laughs> yeah. Don't yep. say anything else. Okay, announcements real quick. Anything uh, that we talked about today is going to be at rta.space slash 13 for any show notes, any th- episodes we mentioned, any other podcasts, all sorts of stuff. And if you're listening to this and you came from Libsyn, thank you for subscribing. Hello. If you're listening to this and you came from Spotify, thank you for joining us. Good morning. We- I have yes. a topic. What? Friends. We'll get to that next week. Goodbye. Hold on, hold on. Don't say why do people say goodbye. Hold on, before you go, wait, I was gonna say before you go to sleep here. So if you came from somebody, if you came, <laughs> if you can't somebody, <laughs> if you came from somebody, <laughs> if if you came from Spotify, thank you for joining us. If a friend recommended you to us, which is me, thank you for joining. I recommended that if friend. If you and that friend are a yours. friend of a friend, and you want to listen to, and you want to share the show, share your favorite episode. I'm it's very Twitter. easy. Just share it at rta.space slash that episode number. On Instagram, too. 
Yeah, if you want to share Instagram, take a picture Don't of you. Don't try to find out my Twitter and Instagram. Yeah, that's in the show notes, but... Really? <laughs> yeah, it is. Wait, I don't have Instagram, do I? No, she doesn't. But oh, yeah. take a picture... I was going to make oh, one. Yeah, share it on Instagram, take a picture of yourself, listen to the podcast, do anything yeah, you want. look, okay, goodbye, you're going to check this week. What? I mean, well, whenever week you release this, you're going to check, uh, and whoever shares it on Instagram, I will make an Instagram account. Okay. And if she'll follow you. If somebody... And she'll follow you, okay? Yeah, yeah, okay. Okay. Also, if uh, you don't know where to start or if you're new listening here, check out our backlog of old episodes, and that's at rta.space, and all our episodes will be there. Also, if you like to use YouTube and you don't like listening on your phone, we're going to start posting all of our shows. Our whole backlog is going to get posted to YouTube. And if you want to subscribe to that channel, that's youtube.com slash space. Um, there's a bunch of, we have two of our comedy videos on there. I'm still working on some new ones, so don't get on me. Common day. Common day videos. Comedy. Common day videos. Common. Yes, and we are working on some video ideas. Yeah, to be made in the distant yes, years. very distant future in a galaxy far, far away. Okay. Don't start another movie. <laughs> That's it. If you want to follow us, uh, I'm at Corbin Garcia. She's at unknown. Not really. Extra Sophie, I yeah. think. Yes, on Extra Wait, are you Sophie doing email Twitter. or Twitter? On Twitter. Oh. Uh, thank you to Poddington Bear for his music as our intro and outro music. We are executive produced by... <coughs> and that is all. Thanks for listening, and... We are going to end the show. Well, I am. I'm going to end the show different this week. He always says, why do people say goodbye? The end. So, I'm going to say total opposite. Why do some people say hi and other people say hello and other people say what's up? All my friends are Don't start the <laughs> outro music! <laughs>